Hey, what's up, guys? Dope Center 930 here, and I just got back from FedEx right now um, with this box. It was actually bigger, but I opened up the first box. Uh, I guess they tried to deliver today, but I wasn't around, so I had to go wait in line for like 45 minutes because it was pretty busy because um, of all the holidays. Um, but I have right here the Matrix Freedom PCB. Uh, what this is is it is a replacement PCB for all slim light on DG16 D4S drives. Um, some of the features of it are it's compatible with all drives. It has an external programmer to enable and disable the write protect and reflash firmware. Um, there's sold, uh, solderless options. Uh, you can program it using any SATA programming tool and it's fully compatible with Jungle Flash which is an awesome feature. So let me go ahead and open it up. I haven't even opened it myself yet. Let's see what we got. Okay, so here's actually the main PCB. Let's see if there's anything else. And there is. <clears throat> Alright, so we have got, uh, let's see, a ribbon cable and a bunch of stuff. To be honest with you, I am not even sure how to install this yet because they have not submitted a tutorial on their website, so I don't know if I'm going to go ahead and try to mess with it myself yet or wait. I'll probably contact the Matrix team and see what they say about it before I throw this into my slim. Let's see. Okay, so here it is. Feels really sturdy. I could good quality. It's got some wires coming out of it. It's already pre-soldered onto the board right there. Let's go ahead and open these up. Let's see if I can find some scissors. Uh -uh. Yes. I believe the install might to Executor products because I know that they do have a similar uh, PCB or unlock device, so I will look into that and see. Right here, it looks like we've got some kind of a QSB with a there's a USB plug in right there. I'm guessing maybe uh, with this, you're going to read and write the NAND through just that USB port, which would be pretty cool. does not want to open up. I think for now I want to do unboxing videos. I'm going to use my actual webcam so I have both hands free. It seems like it would be a lot easier. Okay, so we have got... I have no idea what this is. A little metal component of some sort, which seems to maybe go on these sticky pads. I'm not sure what it does at all. It doesn't look like an electrical component of any sort. Let's go ahead and open the last piece up. And here's this. Oh, I'm guessing this is what they mean by a uh, solderless if you want, because you can unscrew the top and the wires from the light on will go right into this uh, this spot. This actually looks pretty similar to um, to the actual uh, Team Executors product. So I will probably take a look over at theirs right now and see um, their instruction guide and see if it looks anything you know like something I could use and then I'll go based off that but hopefully I'll have a tutorial up um, uh, I probably have to wait until I get my stuff from X consoles which will be here Friday definitely because um, I'm getting my CK3i as well as my PCI add-on for my computer so that I can program uh, <laughs> Uh, flash drives, so I probably have to wait till then. But uh, in the meantime, I'm going to be, you know, researching as much as I can and contacting the Matrix team to see if they can give me any uh, support on how to actually install the product because I have no idea. Like I said, so uh, be looking for that. And uh, yeah, that's about it. Thanks for watching, guys. Uh, Dope Center 930, and uh, this was a Matrix uh, Freedom board. So, all right, I'm out.